So Labour uh, leader, so opposition leader Keir Starmer is, is, must be having a pretty good Friday after the by-elections. Yeah, he must be skipping around his house this morning. Uh, this was the first opportunity to take the temperature of the nation after the party conferences and also ahead of the general election. And they've overturned two huge Conservative majorities in these two by-elections, really just to mark the scale of it. Mid-Bedfordshire had been Conservative since 1931. You've seen three... Uh, uh, wins for Labour in by-elections with swings over 20%. That hasn't happened since the run-up to the 1997 landslide under Tony, Tony Blair. Uh, so it is going to put a spring in the step of Keir Starmer. But on the flip side, to put some cold water on all of this, it isn't a national poll. We're still a way away from a general election. Um, and Starmer's got almost twice as many seats to turn over than Tony Blair had in the run-up to 1997 because of just how badly Jeremy Corbyn did against Boris Johnson. Nonetheless, this is not the mood music that Rishi Sunak is going to be want to be hearing while he's jetting around the Middle East doing his diplomacy or uh, as he tries to set up his general election mm -hmm. campaign. Uh, so the question must be, is he going to put the general election off right to the 11th right. hour till January 2025?